My next guest was nominated for an Academy Award last year for his role in The Karate Kid, and he has just completed the sequel, which is called, would you believe this, The Karate Kid 2. <laughs> he is also the first guest we've had on this program who helped design the Polaris missile. Please welcome Pat Morita. Pat? Hi, Pat. How are you? Nice to see you. Come on over here. Probably not a bad idea after after that uh, assortment of animals. The cougar was over here. <laughs> yeah, the cougar, yeah. Yeah, I still smell of bear. <laughs> How you doing? Great, Dan. Uh, Great. Now, is this true you actually helped design the uh, Polaris missile system? Um, uh, the last straight job I had before I got into show business. Mm -hmm. When was, was that? Oh, like 25 years ago. Right. I was working for a missile's outfit. and. Uh, uh, what was the name of the missile outfit? Uh, Aerojet. Aerojet. Aerojet General. Uh -huh. uh, uh, right. And I got transferred to the nucleonics division oh. of the missiles yeah, outfit. Yeah. So the Polaris was uh, um, one of the gigs we had. Did you actually? Uh, uh, <laughs> you actually? You actually? Uh, what did you do? Did you help design it? Did you help uh, weld it? Or no, what, my, what my job. I was in uh, computers. I was in charge of operations. Uh -huh. So on the one hand, we used to have like um, physicist department right. guys with doctors of math doing quantum theory, mm -hmm. elliptical equations, something that we'd have to put into machine language mm -hmm. for them to get answers so they could figure out how yeah. we could get to the moon and I see. stuff. So you, you would take the it theory and apply it to the basic okay. technology. Yeah. 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 Uh, and well, why did you give that uh, uh, career up? Because show business was waiting. And, uh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but show business <laughs> is always waiting for everyone. Uh, you went from there to stand up? Yeah. Yeah. And uh, little clubs in San Francisco. Yeah. yeah. W how did you? I mean, how did you make the transition? Was it complete and abrupt? Like that. Yeah. And what was your stand-up act? Harry like? Carey, Japanese guy, yeah. just trying to, you know, be smart, earn a living with my mouth, and. Uh, <laughs> uh, now, now your your first name was not actually Pat. Is Noriyuki. It? Noriyuki. Noriyuki. That's the credit used on in the, the Karate Kid. You know, that's interesting. Um, Jerry Weintraub, the executive director. The wealthiest the man wealthiest, in show business. Yeah, who now owns studios and yeah. executive producer. Is he a nice enough guy or? A... Yeah, when you get to know him, yeah. But yeah. biz is tough. You know? Fair? Is he fair? Yeah, I think so. Okay, not a weasel. But, but no. <laughs> Maybe. I ain't looked that you, far. You said it. You said it. You heard it here. This is the man who but said it. to audition for the part. I don't know. <laughs> no, no, he didn't want me to use, you know, Pat Morita because he figured a lot of people would just remember me from Arnold and like that, right? Mm -hmm. So he goes, you know, I wish we could get a real Japanese guy to play this guy. <laughs> he right? said that to you. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so I said, I just, I said, well, uh, you could, uh, I have a Japanese name, yeah. Noriyuki, that I was born with. Very nice name. You could have an act if it, that yeah. would make me more Japanese for this Japanese role. And so there you go. Yeah. Now, now how yeah. from Noriyuki did you get Pat when you changed it the first time? Uh, when I was going all through high school and, and I was a young man, everybody knew me by Nori, mm -hmm. you know. Except uh, uh, guys I hung around with playing pool, they call me Duck. Duck? Yeah, because uh -huh. I used to wear a DA, you know. Oh, yeah. Uh, when yeah. I had hair. Yeah. Used to, you know. <laughs> but um, uh, after, because uh, comics about that time, they were either a Jackie this or a, or a Pat, Pat yeah. Matt, and, yeah. and a Pat fit. I, mean, I don't look like a Jackie. No. <laughs> <laughs> uh, and and uh, t tell the people how you were uh, billed. What was your sort of... Uh, you know. oh, oh, well, in some of the clubs we used to work, um, uh, the drummer used to have to, you know, as he's playing off mm -hmm. the stripper, he'd have to, in, you know, uh, uh, introduce me, the MC, or whatever the next yeah. spot was. And one night he said, and now here he is, folks, the hip nip himself. Uh, <laughs> you know, and the title kind of stuck, yeah. you know, and people... Now, what kind, of, what kind of things did you do in the act when you were the, the hip nip? Just, what just, were you doing? Uh, they were, uh, do you well, remember a line, one line you could share with us here? I used to tell people that December the 8th, 41, I became colored. Because <laughs> the day before was the only good day we had. Uh -huh. you know, yeah. Uh -huh. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Now, was that the big closer or was that an opening remark? No, that was probably kind of one of the... I mean, you either grabbed them or you didn't. Yeah, yeah, you know. yeah. Uh, now, tell me about the Academy Award nomination. Did that uh, really uh, turn your life around? Was that, like, the biggest thing oh, that's yeah. happened for you? Oh, yeah. Oh, gee, I mean, you know, uh, uh, I don't have to read for parts anymore. Yeah. Um, 
I can afford a Jewish gardener now. <laughs> That's from the old. <laughs> yeah, it's from the old. <laughs> Some of those lines never go out of style, do they? You can yeah. use them. Yeah. They come out when you need. Yeah, them, absolutely. <laughs> it's like a good investment. Really. <laughs> uh, and uh, now, do you know much about karate? See, for me, like, uh, if, if someone asks me personally, you yeah. know, uh, uh, the only thing I know about karate, what I could never understand is to demonstrate you're macho, you got to go out and break a brick. You right. Know? Oh, I used to think if you hated that guy bad enough, take the brick and throw it at him. Yeah, there you go. You know, break the brick over sure. him. Sure. You know, uh, is yeah. that from the act, too? That left over from the act? No, but that's yeah. a new <laughs> philosophy of mine. Uh, the Karate Kid 2, when will it be available for folks to go see? I think in June. Oh, terrific. Well, congratulations on your success. Nice to see you again, Pat. Thanks for coming by. Thanks for Pat Marina, ladies and gentlemen. We'll be back here with Willie DeBlake.